we'll get a driving range. <laughs> I'm hired to pick up the golf balls. Start out at 250 and uh, make, uh, make my way in. Then I come in, I load them. You bring them in. You watch them. That's a good summer job. It's pretty easy, actually. So when I was a kid, I would come to this driving range, but my parents would never let me hit the balls. We could only play miniature golf. It's kind of a mystery what was over here, what these dividers were for, and what that cart was out riding around. I didn't know what it was. And now I'm working here. They're probably happy there's a cage on it. It's pretty simple. I mean, it's fun. You gotta hit the guy in the cart. <laughs> I think we'll take our frustrations out. Nice little club, nice little ball. I think it relieves the day's frustrations, actually. Usually you know who's aiming for you and who's just trying to hit the golf ball. There's one. Doesn't bother me the first time, just something that you gotta expect. You will pay five bucks, I like to give them the money. Money's worth, so. <laughs> I tease them, actually. I come in real close and then I drive out. Because they can't hit me anyways. And if they do, it doesn't hurt, so it doesn't matter. They try and show off to their friends or impress their family or something like that. How it's impressive, I don't know, but they do it. It's funny when you get hit in the cart. You just watch them and you see them, uh, you know, trying to just aim and be precise and you're moving around and they can't get you. It's funny. If I see someone that's really bad and they're trying to hit me, I'll just stop right in front of them. And some, most of the time they don't hit me, but once in a while I get lucky. <laughs> 